admit it. I am a hedonist, and anybody who isn't is a damn fool. I, uh, I appeal for the man, the man who gets up in the morning, long before the daylight, comes home at night, long after that light has faded from the sky, and has given his life, his strength, his toil, to make others rich and great. I'm pleading for the day when we can overcome cruelty with kindness and hatred with love. Well, a lot of what Darrow did probably wouldn't be tolerated today because Darrow uh, gave those great summations in an era when the summations could go on for three days or something like that, and when speeches could go on for a day or two. Remember, that's before television, before uh, and, and largely before uh, movies, uh, so that they were the entertainment of the day. If you can take a thing like evolution and make it unlawful to teach it, then next you can ban the books and the newspapers. See, if you can do one, you can do the other. What makes people, good people, get so silly about their religion? We got the Espionage Act, huh? In the name of patriotism, locking people up for their ideas, their speech, not their conduct. Back to the alien and sedition laws. I mean, history always repeats itself. That's what's wrong with history. And I'm often asked the, the question, what, is the, uh, 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 what, is the, what are the parallels and similarities be between being a trial lawyer and being an actor? Well, in the trial lawyer, of course, I'm using my own words. And uh, as an actor, I'm usually using somebody else's words. But uh, this I can tell you, in both cases, it's utterly important, whether you're an actor or a trial lawyer, that you be sincere. Because as the actors like to say to one another, don't let me catch you acting, which is a great remark, and as the trial lawyers say, please, don't think you can get away with insincerity because the jury will spot it. Well, I know I'm a sinner, but as I look out there at all of you, I know I'm in good company.